once we start to hit out on field trips, we usually go do some uh, team building exercises for us to start off the year so that they learn to work together. A good place to do this is SEED in Halifax or the Discovery Centre in Halifax. They have some excellent team building exercises that you can do. The main part of the grade 10 year is for career exploration. Uh, these are field trips that are set up to go and visit as many as possible career fairs, uh, different companies and things like that so kids can get a real taste of what the working world is like or something that they might have interest in or discover that they might be interested in. So we try to take them on anywhere between 12 and 15 different uh, experiential trips that they can uh, kind of get their hands dirty and, and learn what the jobs are all about. As you can see, we cover a broad spectrum of trips, anything from the military to the fire department to construction. So kids try to take it all in and learn as much as they can about different careers so that they can kind of set up their education geared towards post-secondary education in a career-related field. We also give back to the community, uh, programs like Reading Buddies or donating to the food bank or food drives and building tables for home shelters are things we've done for, uh, to help the local community. We cover things like first aid, witness, occupational health and safety. Uh, we do food handling and food training uh, courses as well. Uh, it's all to give the kids an opportunity to take courses to make them the most hireable individual as they head out into the workforce. In grade 11 and grade 12, students have to work 300 hours. Um, as you can see here, they do co-op programs, uh, anywhere from Sobeys to Atlanta Cats and everything in between physiotherapy and doctors. We have everybody that hires our students on and they have a really great time. One of the perks of being an O2 is you're guaranteed a seat in the program of your choice at NSCC. So we do a lot of work with NSCC throughout the year, many tours and uh, test drive their programs and uh, the experiences for the kids to use. My favorite part of the year is the Nova Scotia Skills Competition. Uh, these are competitions for kids that can compete in anything from carpentry to robotics to job skills demonstration. Uh, they go to the waterfront campus or the straight campus and NSCC and, and compete. Uh, we've been fortunate enough to have a winner. Uh, Brianna is the gold medal winner right there. She won for job description. She did that movie theater makeup. Awesome. We wrap up each year with a construction project. Uh, kids in the past have built picnic tables and a greenhouse or a landscape in the front of the school. We work with a local Redfield tradesman to take the kids through each step of the process. And uh, it's all student-led and driven with the supervision of uh, local handymen, and they uh, do a really good job at it, as you can see here. A perk of the program is kids get a chance to work in the summer uh, through Test Drive or Building Futures for Youth. Uh, they have a chance to earn credits in the summer and get paid. Our kids get a chance to do some cool stuff. Uh, one of our students spoke at a press conference for the government of Nova Scotia and Brianna at the skills competition met the Prime Minister last year, so they do some pretty neat things. Thank you for watching and listening. I hope you learned a little something about the O2 program in Muscadelva Rural High School. Thank you.